Welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica and today I have my update for the Golden Girls Project Pan. This is a Pantastic Ladies collab and I'm going to have everyone that has joined in listed down below so go check them out. This was created by Elise and the dates on this started September 14th of 2018 and goes until May 9th of 2019. We had to pick at least seven categories and there was like some descriptions for each category that taught us or told us how to pick the product for that particular category. I had finished prior to this update four of my seven products and that, that was a minimum, but because I have so many projects, I stuck with a minimum on this one. Um, and I have finished one since the last update and I'm very happy about that. I finished my Blanche category, which is a sexy themed or sexy product. And for her, I chose the Glamour Doll Eyes Eyeshadow in Nymphette. It looks like crazy black here. It really isn't. It was like a dark blue with glitter. And I'm not a big fan of blue eyeshadows or eyeliners. I mean, like I wear blue, but I don't I don't normally like it on my face. But I really like this one. I liked it a lot. I had pressed it into a pan and I used it that way. It was easy to put in my magnetic palette. And it is done. It is all gone. I would show you the pan, but I've already pressed a pigment into that pan. And um, so there's something else in there. So... The baggie, it is done. I'm happy about that. So now I'm up to five of the seven done and I have two more to show you. The first one is for rose, obviously something rose themed. I chose the Fresh Sugar Rose or Rose Lip Treatment. I use it like a lip balm. I'm assuming that's what a lip treatment is because that's what it feels like. I have made some amazing progress on this one. Just the tiniest little bit left and you can see my lines. I am at that bottom red line now. I don't know why it leans like that. I've seen other people show progress and there's leans as well. It is a very soft product and I think that's probably why I like it because it feels moisturizing on your lips. I have no doubt this will be done by the next update because if you look at my progress, it's pretty steady on there. So if I have that same progress, this product will be done. And the only other product I have left in is for Dorothy, and that is a good lipstick or blush. I went with the Estee Lauder Sugar Honey. This one doesn't have quite as good progress, but I am making some progress on this one. Let me show you my progress lines. I don't know if you can see that red line there. I was at gold last time, and now I'm at the bottom gold right there. Hard to line up because I'm just not that steady. But I am making progress. I am hoping that progress will go quicker now that I have finished my Nectarine lipstick. So this is going to be my primary lipstick now. It is what I am wearing on my lips today. And I really enjoy it. It's a nice creamy formula. I think it's a, a nice color. It's a little on the warmer side, but it's like a neutral with a hint of warm, I think. And, um, and I really like it. So I will be wearing this quite a lot. I'll be wearing this look or a variation of this look quite a lot until the end of the year, until certain makeup products are done. Anyway, that is everything that I have for this update. Again, I am going to have everyone listed down below, so go check them out and show them some love. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and until I see you in my next video, have a beautiful day.